now know who the man is who was shot and killed in Valley View yesterday morning. It is a possible case of road rage, deadly road rage. Thanks for joining us first at four. I'm Nicole Versansky. And I'm Brian Duffy. Today, 19 News is learning more about the victim, a man who will be missed. A conversation today with a co-worker of that victim about losing his friend. Our Harry Boomer has been covering the story since it broke. He has the new information, Harry. Well, guys, the man that was killed yesterday, a little bit further down Bricksville Road here, had a wife, some children, and some dogs. His coworker told me he loved them all and that he was a valued coworker. He's an all-around nice guy. Tragedy what happened. Christopher and Dexler remember it today as a great friend. The 41-year-old shot and killed Thursday morning on Bricksville Road in Valley View. His co-worker, Kevin, says Chris was in a good mood when he left to make a run for the company he worked at for 10 years. I saw him 10 minutes before that. He was here. He was in a great mood. He was talking about his dogs. He was talking about his wife. He was talking about, you know, homesteading and 15 years with his wife. So he was in a good place. He was in a good mood. A source tells 19 News that this may have been a case of road rage. I've personally seen him help a lot of people. He's gone through a lot. He had a daughter that he really loved. He had a couple stepsons that he really cared for. He, of course, he loved his wife. While Valley View police remain tight-lipped about the investigation and what exactly happened, and Dexter's family and friends still can't believe the husband, father, and co-worker is gone. How are people around here dealing with uh, this tragedy? Uh, everybody's still in shock, of course. You know, just happened yesterday. So everybody's still kind of dealing with it in their own ways. But he's been, he was here for almost a decade. You know, we worked side by side on a lot of projects. You know, he was our road guy, so he was out all the time. While there were several unanswered questions, police did arrest two people shortly after the shooting. A burned out car was found about two miles from the scene on Brexville Road. As we wait for police to finish their investigation, Kevin will remember the good times he had with Chris. I don't know. He'll be missed. He'll definitely be missed. It has still not been definitely determined if it was a road rage incident or not. BCI and the Valley View Police still investigating that. And the two adults that were arrested, well, they are still behind bars. In Brexville, I'm Harry Boomer, 19 News.